we're getting a new thing today. We're getting a new thing. A new thing. We have to drive five hours to go get one. Five hours. New things. So we've been contemplating getting a new daily driver for a while and we finally just said we can go get one now so we're here at Nissan and we're looking to test drive one of these. Okay. So which way did you want me to go? Uh, right. Through way. This guy should not be crossing right now. So is this the only one you have in stock or are there black ones too? And... There is a black one too, yes. Okay. So what do you think of it so far, Denise? Um, totally different transmission feel, but I like it. Yeah, I like it also. I had a chance to drive it too. Didn't film because Denise didn't tell me. We're looking for a black one now. We're gonna compare the white one to the black one, see what one like better. Bye bye. He's gonna try and find us a black one, and we're just gonna compare them which one, which color we like more, and then we'll probably go talk numbers and see what we can get. <laughs> Did you just buy it? Hey Denise, we made a joint decision that we got a black one. Black on black on black on black on black. <laughs> and now we're just waiting for it to come back from fuel because they're going to give us a free tank of fuel. Hopefully it was smart put premium fuel in it. Yeah. We paid $36,000 for it and they're going to give us some free fuel. Buddy! 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 <laughs> we didn't even look at it. Yeah! Quick and simple. Wow. Awesome. We decided we were going to come down and do this at 10 o'clock last night. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Through the moment. That's it. Ah, there she is. Right? Black on black on black on black. Like I said, besides the red trim yeah. on the seat. Yeah. Oh, it's a metallic black. That looks cool. Just beautiful. I'm very happy that you're happy. <laughs> All right, so what's gonna happen now is we're gonna do some running around before we take full possession of it. They're gonna clean it, get the 3M that we bought applied, and we're gonna get the registration and eat and do some running around and we'll come back and we'll actually pick up the car after and then we have to drive home. This is it, we have everything. We went to the registry, we got the registration, uh, we went to a car place, we got Kenta's coupler for the Mustang build and we got Denise's horse things. Now we go get, get a new car. Let's go get our keys. 
So we were going to take the vehicle, come back and get it 3M'd another day, but they insisted to, to do it today. So we went and burned three hours to give them time to do it. And we come back and they're still screwing around with it. We still have to drive five hours home. Awesome. Alright, so now we wait some more because, well, they didn't tell us that they needed the car for like 97 hours to do the 3M. So what happened was we had everything done at like 1 o'clock, I think. And we were just going to take it home because Denise has to start her orientation tomorrow at another job. But they were real adamant on doing the 3M now instead of us taking it and bringing it back. And we were actually willing to take the risk of getting a rock chip in it before putting the 3M on. Just because we had to make this, we had to make it home in time so she can go to work tomorrow. So now we're sticking around here because they're still not done with the car. It's four o'clock now. We still have a five hour drive back, so. <laughs> There's no SD on this one uh, for the uh, navigation. Oh, yeah, yeah. What about the cover that goes here? The towing cover, yeah. Damn, it looks sexy though. There's a couple of um, like scratches here. Uh, yeah, so you can see them. But that's because we didn't get the vehicle buffed out before we bought it. We were just on a short time. So we're actually gonna come back another time and we'll get it buffed out and then the rest of the 3M on the front put on because we left one piece out. We're just really short on time. Right, Denise? Yeah, it sucks. How do you like it? It's awesome. You boost now. How's it like to join Boosted Lifestyle? I was already part of it. You very approve of it. No, I was already part of it. Super doesn't count. Cobalt doesn't count. This one's yours. Wheel shaking or something? Yeah. We'll just torque the tires and see. Alright, so Denise just handed the car over to me and something definitely is not right here. Uh, it feels like the wheels are out of balance or something. I don't know if you can see it, but the steering wheel is shaking. And the car is pulling to the right as I let go of the wheel, so... Fuck. Can't really catch a break with this place. something in the seat of my pants that um, is shaking and I'm gonna okay I have a bit more unzoomed here okay I'm gonna let go of the wheel you can see that I'm pointing towards the center line I'm let go and I'm off the road so it's pulling to the right pretty hard which I shouldn't be doing at all so besides like the dealership issues and the clearly pulling to the right issue, the car as a whole, I actually really enjoy it. Um, for how small it is outside, it's actually kind of spacious inside. You actually forget that there's four doors. I uh, went to go reach in the rear seat from behind the driver's seat, <laughs> forgetting that there was rear doors on it. Um, it rides really smooth. I'm doing about 115 right now, and it's just over, 2,000 RPM. Uh, our average fuel economy is 7.5 liters per 100 kilometers, which is better than the Cobalt. The Cobalt right now, if it's doing the same speed as me, it's right probably... 184 kilometers. So if the Cobalt is um, doing the same speed as me, it's probably doing 27, 2800 RPM. And it's a 2 liter, so... Uh, it's doing about 8 liters per 100 kilometers. Um, the vehicle itself, I think, weighs 3,200 pounds. All-wheel drive. And that is actually lighter than my Supra is. I really enjoy all this black on black on black on black the whole way around the vehicle. So, uh, I just realized I have D mode. So, when I want to get rid of D, I just... I just... Oh, yeah. Uh, D mode. 